Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. My name is Derek Ray, with me in the commentary position is the Arsenal legend Lee Dixon and we're focusing on live action from Italy's top division, Serie A. It is Torino and they face Sassuolo. Thanks Derek, good atmosphere here. Everybody looking forward to what should be a really entertaining game. And a look at the starting lineup for Torino. Wing backs are important in this setup. Did you enjoy your experience of playing at wing back, Lee? Not at all. Under Bruce Rock, it's a very, very demanding role, as we can see. The full backs are exposed both offensively and defensively. Lots of support inside them, but going forward, they need to try and get the ball into the box for the two up front. And so for the Sassuolo starting lineup. Pretty well balanced this formation, Lee. Yeah, it can be a 4-2-3-1 in the offensive mode, but it can also go back to a 4-5-1 when you're defending. The lone striker will be supported by the three just behind him, especially the number 10 who will be given a free roll. Voivoda. The ball with Lukic. He's taken on his opponent here. Lopez. Now Juricic. And unable to keep the ball. Filip Juricic. An attack full of promise. Now Lopez. They've won back possession. Sasha Lukic. Moving forward effectively. Zadza. And dispossessed. Beautifully weighted ball. And the flag does go up. Must have been close. Caputo pressing as a team using his physical strength to shield it it looks promising and a touch off the defender last of all so a corner Played into the centre of the box. Corner given. Yeah. And now the delivery. Can he finish here? Good defending to prevent the chance. Philip Juricic. An inability to keep hold of the ball there. The high press was very much on. 
Zadza. Can they get in behind them? He must finish! And danger still. It has gone over the touchline for what'll be a throw-in. Mert Muldur. Lianko. And Saldi. Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. Obiang. Well, since they have the ball, the referee playing advantage here. Locatelli. Caputo. And showing fine vision. Driven in. And it's in! the defence well here's the replay and it's a good ball in hard and low causing plenty of issues for that back line but I have to say after that the keeper doesn't cover himself in glory near post left exposed and he's punished So the match has restarted. 1 0 here. Sassuolo, con il numero 25, Domenico Berardi. Lovely first touch. That wasn't easy. Mandragora. Rincon now. And Saldi. Well, look at the stats. Torino enjoying the bulk of possession here. But after that, it's been really disappointing. Players are looking at each other. You've got to take control. You've got to take responsibility yourself. Make something happen in this game. Just straying offside. Well, no stopping him. Zadza. An effective challenge. He's given us away. Verdi. And able to get a body in the way. Denied again. Takes the shot. And that's sound goalkeeping. It'll be a corner. Well, the crowd are doing their bit. Can the players do theirs? They need an equaliser. And firing it into the area. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half-time here. You've certainly got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Lee. Well, Derek, it certainly was a good 45 minutes from the lad. Obviously got the goal to give him the lead, but he's looked very, very lively as well. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Lopez. Locatelli with it. Filip Juricic. Well, he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. Lianco. Rolando Mandragora. Useful looking ball, chance here, 
In it goes! That will greatly help the cause. Now they only need to keep concentration levels high. Well, here's the replay. It's a really lovely through ball. And he had choices of what type of finish to apply. And bang, he goes for the smash. Lovely goal. Here it is now, a substitution. Well, a second goal for them here. Goal del Sassuolo, con il numero 8, Maxime Lopez. Viene perfezionato il cambio nelle file del Torino. Esce dal campo. Con il numero 8, could do damage. Good stop from the keeper. And the referee has given them a corner. Played into the centre of the box. And he didn't miss by a massive margin at all. Rincon on the ball Christian Ansaldi Simone Zadza takes aim can they put it away and the keeper has custody of the ball but just a few seconds beforehand he had a big save to make well keep hold of it have a breather because that first save deserves us all to look at him and clap well the coach will be pleased with the midfield area they've created a lot of chances it's just the forward's job now to put the ball in the back of the net they're behind in the game but for how much longer not a good pass Zadza big opportunity well, the keeper making sure that was pushed well away from danger He's found a pocket of space. Must be! And a goal! To increase their advantage to three! Can they be stopped? Well, let's look at this again. Magical football on the break. Surprise is the key. But you do have to ask questions about the keeper. Could he have done better here? I think so. You can't keep getting beat at the near post like that. It's a massive lead and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Rincon, Rolando Mandragora, Mergim Vojvoda, crossed into the penalty area. Well, nothing productive, really. Well, the ref will hear the crowd all right. We can hear him from here. He's taking some stick. Goalkeeper's ball, the cross delivered too close to him. Domenico Berardi. Terrific block there. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Rolando Mandragora. Verdi. He's in behind. 
And there it is, a goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at their best. Well, it's good play. Ian Wright always told me, stand in the middle of the goal. It sounds simple, but you don't have to get a lot of goals from that position. Well, the goal again, albeit from a different angle. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. No shortage of goals in this match. 3-1. Oh, tremendous block. And he read it well. Mandragora. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. And snuffing out the danger. And the referee has decided to add on three additional minutes. Caputo. And just the one minute left in normal time here. Lopez. He's given it straight to the opposition. And that is that. The referee blows his whistle for full time. And it's a victory for the visitors, Lee. Well, there's no doubt about the winner in the end and fully deserved for me. The fans can go home happy today, Derek. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance this evening, Lee. Well, clearly the difference between the two sides today. Two goals, a really good performance, ran into the channel, did everything right. Absolutely, nine out of ten.